Hi everyone, it's Tatiana from Tatiana's Everyday Food and welcome back to my kitchen. You cannot go wrong with strawberries on Valentine's Day. So today I'm going to show you guys how to make an amazing dessert with the berries. I'm going to make my strawberry mousse dessert. So I have a strawberry mousse base and I'm going to add some chopped strawberries, a little strawberry jello. And to top things off, I'm adding a chocolate covered strawberry on the top. This is the perfect dessert if you're having a romantic dinner for two, then you'll have lots of leftovers for the week. Or if you're hosting a party, this is the perfect little treat. Everybody is going to love it. I'm going to start my mousse by making my whipped cream first. So I have two cups of heavy whipping cream and I'm going to pour that into my mixer bowl. And to my cream, I'm going to add one third cup of white granulated sugar. And now I'm going to mix the cream and the sugar together until I get a really nice and fluffy whipped cream. I have my cream whipped and now I'm just going to place it into the refrigerator until I'm ready to use it. And now I'm going to get started on my strawberry base. So in a bowl here, I have eight ounces of cream cheese that I've softened at room temperature. To my cream cheese, I'm going to add um, some melted white chocolate. So I had half a cup of white chocolate chips and I just melted those in the microwave. I can add that right in. Next, I'm going to add in half a cup of sweetened condensed milk. Next, I'm going to add in one teaspoon of strawberry emulsion. And bakery emulsion is like a concentrated extract that also has food coloring. So if you can't find an emulsion, you can just add plain strawberry extract. I'm going to drop that right in. You want to mix all those ingredients together until they're nice and smooth. And now it's time to add our strawberry. So I have two cups of pureed strawberries. I just cleaned, diced them, and then I placed them into a food processor and mixed them until they were nice and smooth. I'm going to pour them right in and give this a mix until it's well combined. And to ensure that my mousse sets up nicely, I'm going to be adding some gelatin into my strawberry base. So I have one tablespoon of unflavored gelatin. To that, I'm going to add a few tablespoons of hot water. I'm going to give this a stir and then I'm going to take this over to the microwave and I'm going to microwave this for about a minute. I'm going to stir every 10 seconds until that gelatin is nice and smooth and completely dissolved. I have my gelatin completely dissolved and now I'm going to pour into my strawberry base. I'm going to use my whisk and just mix all that together. And now it's time to combine the whipped cream with the strawberry base. So the first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to add a few heaping scoopfuls of the whipped cream into my strawberry base to thin it out a little bit. And you just want to gently fold that in. And now I'm going to add my strawberry base into my whipped cream. I'm going to add a few ladlefuls at a time. And then use my spatula and very gently fold it in. You want to make sure that that whipped cream stays really light and fluffy. Today I'm going to use a variety of different glass containers and cups and I'm going to grab a scoop and just scoop the filling right into each mug or cup or glass or whatever you're using. And I'm going to top each cup off with some chopped strawberries. I'm going to place my strawberry mousse into the refrigerator and I'm going to let it set up for about an hour, hour and a half before I come back to add my strawberry jello layer. And for my last layer, I'm going to be using some strawberry flavor jello and this is a six ounce package. So into this, I'm going to add in one cup of boiling water and I'm going to stir this with my spoon until it's completely dissolved. And to my dissolved jello, I'm going to add in two cups of ice water. And the ice just helps cool it down faster. So give this a stir until the ice is completely dissolved. My mousse has been in the refrigerator for one hour and it's set up nicely just on the top. And you want to make sure it does set on the top, otherwise when you add the jello, the cream and the jello are just going to mix together. So I'm going to use a small ladle and gently pour that jello right over the chopped strawberries. And I'm going to place my dessert back into the refrigerator and let that jello set up completely. 
My strawberry mousse is all set now and you can just leave it in the refrigerator overnight to set up completely. And now I'm gonna garnish the top of each tree with a chocolate covered strawberry. Now I have a separate video tutorial on how you can make these beautiful chocolate strawberries at home and you can find that on my channel as well. So I'm just gonna drop one at the top of each cup and you could do this right before serving. And that's it for my strawberry mousse dessert. All that's left to do is dig in and give it a try. I'm gonna scoop out some of that mousse along with the strawberry jello. Mmm. This is like strawberry heaven. That mousse is so creamy and smooth, it just melts in your mouth. And I love the addition of the chopped strawberries and that strawberry jello on the top. You guys are gonna love this. Strawberries are my weakness. If you like strawberries, this is the dessert for you and it's gonna be perfect for Valentine's Day, but you don't have to wait until Valentine's to make this dessert. If you do make it, snap a photo of it and share it with me on Instagram or Facebook. You can hashtag it with Tatiana's Everyday Food. Thank you guys for watching and I'll see you next time.